number 11, A part. The equation of the curve is this. Find the equation of the normal to the curve at x equal to 1. So the equation of normal is y minus y1 equal to minus 1 over m x minus x1 where x1 and y1 are the coordinates of the point we already know x equal to 1 so we'll find y for this m is the gradient of the tangent we'll find the gradient of the tangent and negative reciprocal of that will be used for normal y and x are random points on the curve so they need not to be changed with anything so we need to find y and m x one is known to us so let's find y so y1 uh, is same as f1 this is the form this is the equation of the function we'll substitute one in place of x and we'll get corresponding y so one minus one square times one so this is zero so zero times one is zero so y coordinate is zero now we need to focus on m m is the gradient of tangent not normal so which is same as the differentiation of the curve and we'll substitute x equal to one so which is f prime x so uh, one minus x square times x we will find the differentiation of this how uh, we can uh, expand this bracket or we can use product rule let me use product rule so i'm using product rule so in that case it will be the differentiation of the first but no change in second product factor rather plus 1 minus x square will be unchanged but second factor will be differentiated so let's do it differentiation of 1 minus x square will be minus 2x times x plus 1 minus x square remains same and the differentiation of x is 1 this will be minus 2x square plus 1 minus x square all right so now m at x equal to 1 m will be uh, we substitute x is with 1 uh, minus 2 1 square plus 1 minus 1 square so it becomes minus 2 plus 1 minus 1 they cancel out it is minus 2 we wanted the negative reciprocal for the normal so negative reciprocal of minus 2 which will be the gradient of normal so it will be we will reciprocate 2 first so we will 1 over 2 and we will change the sign of negative to positive so positive half is the gradient of normal now we will use the formula y minus y1 equal to minus 1 over m this one okay so y minus y1 we got down 0 and 1 over minus 1 over m is half x minus and x1 is known to us so the answer is y equal to half x minus half this is the equation of the normal let's move on to the b part if x plus 3y plus 3 is a tangent circle center 5 minus 2 i think they mean to say the circle with center at 5 minus 2 find the equation of the circle so let's try to visualize this by drawing a circle okay this is the circle the center is 5 minus 2 the tangent is somewhere they have not specified where so let's draw a tangent somewhere okay this is the tangent and the equation of tangent is uh, uh, 
y let's rephrase this one 3y equal to minus x minus 3 and then y equal to minus 1 over 3x minus 3 over 3 is 1. I divided the whole equation by 3 and we got this one. This is what I want to write here. So y equal to minus 1 over 3x minus 1. Okay. So now uh, let's say that x, y or let's say a, b where this tangent is touching, right? So if we join a, b with the center, we know it will be equal to radius. Yeah, this point a, b lies on the tangent. So let's substitute a and b here. So y is b equal to minus 1 over 3 a minus 1. So this is the relationship between b and a. Now we know that minus 1 third is the gradient of the tangent. Minus 1 third. Let's get another equation in terms of a and b with the help of minus 1 third so that we get a and b where the tangent to the circle is existing. So let's do it. We also know that the angle between the tangent and the radius of a circle is always 90 degree and uh, the gradient of radius will be uh, let's say what is the formula for gradient y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1 if we apply this formula with the radius it will be b minus minus 2 over uh, a minus 5 which will be equal to the negative reciprocal of minus one third which is three so let's cross multiply b plus two equal to three a minus fifteen okay and now we can substitute b by its value from the first equation minus one over three a minus one plus two equal to three a minus fifteen Okay, so what a do we get because of this? Uh, let's bring this 3 also to the right, left side. Minus 1 over 3a minus 3a and these will give me plus 1 and plus 1 if I bring to the other side becomes minus 15 minus 1. This plus 1 will become minus 1 on the right side. Okay, so this 3 times 3 is 9 minus 10 over 3a equal to minus 16. All right, so what do we get here? Minus 10a equal to minus 48. So a comes out to be minus 48 over uh, minus 10, which is minus four, sorry, positive. They cancel out, 4.8. That is the a coordinate of the point on the circle. All right, where this tangent is there. So let's find b now b equal to minus one third i'm using this equation again a we just got 4.8 minus one so three and this will cancel out 1.6 b equal to minus 1.6 and minus one will be minus 2.6 so we know the, both the coordinates of a and b now which is 4.8 and minus 2.6 6 and now we can find the radius and according to distance formula r will be equal to square root of x2 minus x1 square plus y2 minus y1 square all right so it comes out to be okay let's square both sides so that we get rid of the square root and we need r square remember in equation of a circle we need r squared so we can do with r squared so this and the square and square root cancel out so r square equal to 5 minus 4, 4 okay 0 0.2 right yeah 0 0.2 square plus this will be 0 0.6 square which will be 0 0.04 plus 0 0.36 which is 0 0.4 this is r square finally we have f g r square everything do we know the 
regular equation of a circle because finally we have to write the equation of the circle that's the question about here yeah? let's see what is it find the equation of a circle yeah so general equation of a circle is x square plus y square uh, minus 2fx minus 2gy plus c which is equal to actually uh, f square plus g square minus r square and equal to 0. f and g are the coordinates of the center of the circle which is 5 minus 2 here. Okay, so we'll substitute these and we just got r square also so everything will be okay x square plus y square minus 2 times 5x minus 2 times minus 2y plus 5 square plus minus 2 square and plus r square no need to square it because we got for r square 0 0.4 it is minus r square right so we have to write minus here equal to 0 all right so Final, final answer will be x square plus y square minus 10x plus 4y 25 plus 4 29 minus 0 0.4 28.6 0 that's the equation of the circle